Sandra Bland's death was a suicide by hanging. That's what authorities in Texas have concluded after reviewing autopsy results. There were no bite marks or other injuries on her face, on her lips, on her tongues, which would be consistent with a violent struggle. Assistant District Attorney Warren Diaphragm pointed out cut marks to her wrist that seemed to indicate a recent suicide attempt. There were approximately 30 cut marks on her left wrist, <clears throat> which were also in a state of healing. These roughly 30 uh, cut marks were both in a state of scarring and scabbing, indicating that they may have been placed on her body uh, roughly two to four weeks uh, prior to her incarceration. Get out! Wow! Now! When Bland couldn't post the $5,000 bail after she was arrested, she was placed in this jail cell. A fellow inmate in a nearby cell said Bland wasn't eating and was in tears during her three days in custody. She said Bland was also worried about missing the first day of work at her new job. Authorities say Bland had drugs in her system at the time of her death. There have been some instances or claims about a substantial amount of marijuana found in her system. I can tell you that there has been a confirmation of those results. Bland's family has serious doubts that she committed suicide using a plastic garbage bag and are awaiting results of a second independent autopsy. Her funeral is scheduled for Saturday.